what's good guys welcome back to ron's rise news welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video where we get the debut of the new nissan serena minivan now minivans are still quite popular in some parts of the world including japan where modern proposals by local automakers are fighting for supremacy now the latest to join the game is the all-new sixth generation nissan serena coming in the ice powered and hybrid forms armed with plenty of space technology and practicality. Now the new Serena adopts Nissan's latest design language with fancy LEDs merging with the V motion grille at the front and a more sculpted bodywork while retaining the boxy shape that is typical of minivans. Now typical of Japanese models, the minivan is available in two slightly different variations in terms of styling. More specifically, the top spec Serena Luxion has more pronounced bumpers and side skirts featuring a grille that is merging with the lower intake. For those who want something sportier and more premium, there's also the Alltech version with a chrome infused exterior and different upholstery inside. Now the footprint is only slightly increased compared to the previous generation with a length of 4,690 or 4,765 millimeters, 184.6 or 187.6 inches, a width of 1,695 or 1,715 millimeters, 66.7 or 67.5 inches, and a height of 1,870 or 1,885 millimeters, 73.6 or 74.2 inches, and a wheelbase of 2,870 millimeters, 113 inches. Now the focus of minivan buyers is the interior, which is where Nissan designers and engineers put the most effort. The new generation has an extra 120 millimeters, 4.7 inches of driver legroom compared to its predecessor, while the multi-purpose center seat in the second row changes the interior layout from a seven-seater to an eight-seater. Now each passenger has access to smartphone pockets, cup holders, USB ports, and onboard Wi-Fi. Now the dashboard is quite modern with a fully digital cockpit and a button-operated automatic gearbox next to the touch-sensitive panel for the climate controls. And the minivan is also equipped with optional hands-free operated sliding doors and a dual tailgate for easier unloading in tight spaces. Now, hybrid models can also be equipped with an optional 100-volt AC 15,000-watt power outlet. In terms of safety, the flagship Serena Luxion benefits from the ProPilot 2.0 suite, enabling hands-free driving on the highway and remote parking with ability to memorize parking spaces. As for the lesser trims, they all get the regular ProPilot as standard. Now, the automaker claims that the Serena has the most spacious cabin in the minivan segment and the widest windscreen. In a quest to reduce motion sickness, Nissan created a new seat that dampens movements, changed the position of the digital cockpit, and also the sound insulation, fitting a rigid steering wheel, a crosswind deflection structure, and a tighter suspension, and ensured smooth acceleration from the second generation e power system. Now, speaking of which, the hybrid has a 1.4 liter three cylinder engine and a single electric motor producing 161 horsepower, 120 kilowatts, 163 PS, and 315 newton meters, 232 pound feet of torque. There's also an ice only version fitted with a naturally aspirated two liter four cylinder engine that produces 148 horsepower, 110 kilowatts, 150 PS, and 200 newton meters, 148 pound feet of torque. Now this is exclusively matted to a CVT gearbox coming in front wheel drive or four wheel drive guises, unlike the front wheel drive only hybrid. Now the new Nissan Serena is already available to order in Japan and prices range from 2,768,700 yen or 20,098 dollars for the entry level ice power trim and you also have the 4,798,200 yen or 34,842 dollar for the flagship e-power Luxion hybrid. Now notably the latter is more expensive than the high spec variants of both the Toyota and Honda minivan rivals. But with that said, what do you guys think about the new Serena minivan? Let me know down in the comments below. And if you guys did enjoy the video today, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. When you give the video a like, it helps get it up in rankings. More people can see it. And we'll have a big discussion about the high technology of the new Serena minivan debut. Now with that said, if you guys wanna help further support the channel, always check the links down in the description below. We have a one-time link donation for my PayPal, my Cash App, my Venmo, and my Patreon. 
Just in case you guys want to donate an extra dollar or two to the channel, I appreciate that extra love and support, guys. Thank you so much. And make sure you guys check the links in the description for my Ron's Rise merch. Cyber Monday sale is going on now live. If you use the coupon code CYBMON, you get 40% off your entire Ron's Rise purchase. So make sure you guys use that today. And make sure you guys check out my social media links as well. Now subscribe to the channel, but click the notification bell so you don't miss one video. And with that said, you guys be blessed. Have a great day. And we will talk to you guys in the next Ron's Rise News video. Peace.